I believe that I became a, a, a poet, a writer, uh, when I was uh, transcribing my grandma's songs uh, in Mexico. I was about 13 years old. And my grandma used to sing with a mandolin and beautiful songs that she used to play. And I thought at that point that she was um, basically singing from the oral tradition of Mexico. But then uh, I became aware that, not, that those were her own songs. But she had never you know, written down the songs herself. So I decided to then uh, transcribe the songs and I would listen to her and then write down the songs. There were very, very beautiful songs in the, in the Hispanic tradition of, of cuartetos and the ballads and so forth. And so sometimes I will forget the line, I will have to make up for the line because you know, I don't have a very good memory. And so that's how I think I was able to compose then my first collection of poems. It's trying to retrieve the memory of my own grandma, uh, grandmother. And so later on, uh, when I came uh, to the States and then I, I went to school, then I, I got together with other writers and then I became a writer and I published my first collection of poems in 1985 when I was at Stanford.